poverty. It took hard work, pride, and honesty. He used a simple strategy. But Daddy won the war on poverty. Yeah, Daddy won the war on poverty. He won it by being what he thought a man should be. Of course, that was back before the great society became so great. Nowadays, whether a man works or not, well, he, he's going to find something on his plate. And you'd think with each bite, he'd swallow a little bit of pride. But the way he's got it figured, why, it'd even be worse if he was to work for anything less than what he thinks he's worth. Yeah, we're waging a war on poverty, but in a little different way. They're forming new committees, and I hear of them every day. Oh, Daddy had a committee. It wasn't people appointed to give out handouts of pity. He had six kids and a wife. And we held our conferences around the kitchen table with a fork and a knife. Oh, we had a few free meals, but not like the ones that they get today. If we happened to be around neighbor's house at dinner time, why, sure. He'd make a steak. Of course, I don't guess you'd call that charity, cause we do him the same way. We're gonna win this war on poverty. If we don't have the money, we'll get it by God. We might just use our credit. And when everybody is financially fixed with nothing to do, ah, there'll still be a place for the modern day warrior. He can use some of his idle time to build more mental institutions. The protesters, they'll have time to rewrite the Constitution. There'll be something, something somebody'll find. There'll always be pollution, even if it's of the mind. Yes, Daddy.